Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we are just doing a short video about how you can use Google to find copyright images for reference or for any type of your creative work that you may be doing. So here we are on the Google homepage. If you've watched any of these videos that I do, you'll know that I always like to search for grizzly bears because I love painting bears. And once you put your search in the search bar, make sure you click on to images. From here, go to the right and click on tools. And then you'll see this little drop down menu come up hit usage rights and there you can have the option of selecting creative commons licenses or commercial and other licenses so if we click on creative commons licenses these ones are usually um, usually pretty safe you can see actually below here we have websites such as the Wikimedia Commons we have Flickr we have Pixabay um, we have some other places as well so Pixabay you know you're good for sure Wikimedia Commons you're also usually pretty good say I wanted to use this one it's always a smart idea to still go to the source and see if there are anything or see if there are any changes to things that have happened um, or not but as you can see this one here licensing this one's public domain so I could use it for whatever I needed I'm gonna go back here I'm gonna click on this Flickr one here and we're going to go there to that website and here you can see that says some rights are reserved so here I am able to see that I need to give appropriate credit to this um, to this person so even though it's showing up as Creative Commons on Google here um, I still need to give appropriate credit to um, to the creator of that so when you're when you're using the Creative Commons licenses search on Google make sure you're you're looking at that there's also commercial and other licenses here is where we need to be um, need to be wary though because uh, sometimes Google is not always correct um, with the photos that you can use so if I go down here maybe I want to use this one that's also from Flickr I'm gonna go to the website here and see what I need and this one's actually telling me that all rights are reserved which means um, I can't I can't really use it but if you would like to use an image that has all rights reserved or some rights reserved that you'd um, maybe want to get taken away you can always message the photographer and see if you can get permission directly from them to use their image I've done it before and many of them have been happy to do it some of them haven't replied and that's fine you can always um, you can always ask if you're unsure what any of those rights mean you can always click on it here and Flickr will take you to this page and if you scroll down they give you a link here to um, help you understand what each of those restrictions um, might be. So you can go there. I will link this below and you can use that to help you out as well. But like I was saying before, Google is still giving me that here um, as underneath their commercial and other licenses. So just be wary when you're using that. Try to stick with the Creative Commons, but again, always double check where your photos uh, the source of your photos and that will give you the best information um, possible if you have any questions shoot me a comment below if you have any comments um, maybe other places that you find yours you can uh, your photos you can always check out my video and article 10 places to find um, high quality copyright images for free and I'll link that below but thanks for watching this quick video and we will see you next time on Brian Sloan Artist